Top 10 Best African Traditional Styles of All Time and Their Origins Welcome back to you, the entertainer, where we present you the best of African culture. One symbol of Africa's rich cultural heritage is the traditional hairstyles. It distinguishes one culture from one another. In the culture of ancient African societies, the hairstyle was used to signify an element. It symbolizes status economic, marital, and social. It was also used as an instrument of spiritual divination. Today, many of those traditional African hairstyles have crossed the Atlantic into the Western world. While some are almost extinct, many remain peculiar to their origins. Oftentimes, they even help to identify individuals belonging to a certain ethnic group. In this video, we have made a list of 10 prominent hairstyles presenting their historical background and present day appeal. Before we dive into this list, if you're new here, welcome. Be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of our videos. Number 10. Sarawi Conros Sarawi Conros are indigenous to the Sarawi people of Northern Africa. Because North Africans have curly hair, their traditional styles are few. The Sarawis wear conros in the typical Sahelian form, two sections running through the middle, hair extensions then help to form two smaller braids that run down the arms. Number 9. Gala Gala is a traditional hairstyle that is native to the Igbo people of Nigeria. Among the Igbos, it is a symbol of pride and elegance for women. Igbo women usually wear gala on special traditional festivals, traditional marriages and coronations. This hairstyle is unique and stylists use hair extensions on any texture of hair. The key feature of Ngala is the adornment of the style with Igbo bread for added elegance. Number 8. Edamburu Popularly known as Breaded Crown, Edamburu is an African traditional hairstyle native to the Magbetu people of Congo. Edamburu is simply thin braids intricately woven into a crown. The coiffe is impressive used to appreciate the culture of skull elongation among the Magbetu people. Number 7. Himba Dreadlocks Himba is a tribe in northwest Namibia. For the Himbas, dreadlocks symbolizes age and life. Himba stylists use a mixture of butter, oshwe, and goat hair to create the locks. They also use hair extensions and ornamental accessories for beautification. Usually, teenagers wear stands of their dreadlocks hanging over their faces to symbolize their entrance into puberty. When these teenagers are ready to marry, they tie these dreadlocks to display or reveal their faces. Number 6. Oshwe Dreadlocks Oshwe Dreadlocks is a cultural symbol of the Hama tribe of Ethiopia. When the Hama people came to settle at the Omo Valley, they blended into the society of nomads, which they met there. Together with these nomads, they invented this traditional hairstyle and called it Gosha. Hama women create their dreadlocks by binding resin with water, sectioning their hair, and using a mixture to style the hair into locks. To add some beauty, the women wear colorful bearded jewelry. Number 5. Zulu Top Knots As the name implies, this African traditional hairstyle traces its origin from the Zulu people of Southern Africa. In the early centuries, women in these communities used this hairstyle as a status symbol. Only members of the ruling class wore them. These days, although still heavily worn by Zulus, top knots have permitted other cultures such as the Ethiopians and Somalis. Zulu top knot is made from the hair gathered into knots and stretched into sections with a tie. Some women adorn their knots with jewelry. Number 4. African Threads African Thread is a very common traditional African hairstyle all over the continent. Threads are native to the Yoruba people of southwest Nigeria. Over time, threads have become popular all over West Africa. Among Africans, threads have different names from different tribes, some of which include Los, Eko, Bridge, Akula, Songa, and many more. It is a natural hair straightener which has been a major part of hair care routines for centuries. Also, it is a protective style that features many section parts of the hair wrapped in threads. Number 3. Fulani Breads This hairstyle is indigenous to the Fulani people of West Africa. Having originated amongst them thousands of years ago, the hairstyle remains a symbol of identity for Fulani women. Fulani Breads is simply hair parted into the middle and side, then braided into tiny cornrows. 
Most times, wearers adorn them with accessories such as rings and belts. It is becoming a fashion trend and gaining attention among other ethnic groups. Number 2. Bantu Knots Bantu Knots is traditional African hairstyle that originated among the Zulu people of Southern Africa. Throughout its existence, women have worn it as a symbol of femininity and status. The Bantu hairstyle is one in which the hair is divided into sections, twisted, and then wrapped to form spiral knots. Although the hairstyle originated from the Zulus, Bantu is a word that means people in over 300 African languages. Little wonder, it has become so popular among Africans and African Americans. Number 1. Amasunzu Amasunzu finds its roots among the Tutsi and Hutu people of Rwanda. Dating back over 500 years, the Amasunzu was won by people of all social and marital status. Warriors wore it to signify strength and bravery. Single youngest wore it as a symbol of their virginity. It was a hairstyle of class as only the traditional airline flaunted. Amasunzu is a way to beautify the body. This style relies heavily on the body frame of the wearer. It is a collection of rows of hair styled into crescent shapes with sharp contours. There you got it. Those were the top 10 best African traditional hairstyles and their origins. The first thing that you will probably notice is that some of the hairstyles have become so popular that their origin seems lost. Inasmuch as losing the origin of any hairstyle is not something to be proud of, their popularity keeps them from going extinct. We agree that this is not an exhaustive list, however, we would want to hear from you. Which hairstyle is native to your tribe? Let us know in the comment section below. Also, please like this video and subscribe. Thanks for watching.